Okay, I'm showing mm -hmm. the teams. Let me bring that up. There we go. <clears throat> yeah, you want to free to one. I I had no <laughs> idea about the ib things microphone thing. Yeah, no but... joke actually, no joke. And I know it's true 100 percent because, uh, like we talked about ib things as a potential player for CCL season two, and oh. uh, people were saying that he doesn't he doesn't have a mic or I think. I think he doesn't want to use a mic, right? I think that's yeah, actually I mean, what it is. Like, for whatever reason, but... Uh, yeah. Like, he's gonna join the voice channel, but he... Like, he's always muted. <clears throat> but surely he wouldn't do that if he actually competed, no? Uh, but, I no, mean, I, I think that's the... Sense. I think that's the deal with him. I think that's um, how it is, but... Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Is it a catfish? Because he apparently, I mean, I, I mean, I have no, I never, I like, I never played with him, right? But the DNA people are saying that Ip Tings is like very good. Yeah. Um, I think Malo yesterday called him like the the NA Ixia, like a, like very good in Storm League, you know, like uh, like he kind of plays um, all heroes more or less. Yeah, yeah. But uh, yeah, for some reason, he uh, he's not gonna be active in in voice. It's some secret Smurf, yeah, maybe. I mean, honestly, <laughs> I mean, to not speak, it, yeah, like either you have to have some condition, I think, that makes you not want to do it, yeah. or it's legit like some other player that don't want to. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> let them know that you're him. It's Ip Tings is like the the European cluster. It's like guys, yeah, yeah, I can join a team, but I can't talk. And by the way, yeah. I'm really good at the game. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? Yeah. <laughs> All right, good luck, Uki. <clears throat> Tomb first game, and what Tomb, was banned? Uh, Garden, Garden Sky. and Altara? No, wait, what? Is... Yeah. yeah, it's Altara. Altrak in the middle, and then Sky bottom right. Yeah. And Dragon. All right, I like all the maps that are in the pool. Hopefully, we don't. I I don't want to see Battlefield second game or third game. <laughs> you know that like the Nick loves the map, so... by the way. Nick loves Battlefield, I think, and you don't like I mean... it, right? Um... I like it playing like yeah, the rundown comps, but uh, getting into the, like the the poke situation, I don't like it that because it, it's so snowbally. Like, yeah, that's uh, true. If we would have entered like we did the infernal game on battlefield, like Nick <laughs> dying like two three the times, early early, yeah, yeah, then, then should... uh, we would be like free yeah, you level just, lead and yeah, have yeah. a chance. You just lose on BOE if that happens, actually. <laughs> and I I hate that it's so yeah. snowbally. Yeah, actually, Nick, yeah, yellow card on Infernal Shrine's early game. <laughs> I think he he respawns, walks to a wave. He's like, guys, I need to stack yeah, yeah. my level 4. I instantly press yeah, Q yeah. on the minion wave. <laughs> oh, shit, they're here. <laughs> I mean, we didn't actually call the rotations that yeah, well. That is true. And we usually do that better. Yeah. But uh, he, he should also, like, ask someone to cover for him. Or, like, can he be here? Like, yeah, check yeah. those things before he actually <laughs> runs it. Wait, they banned Deckard, actually. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Hebby was actually. It might be one of his best heroes, actually. What I've seen. I think Hebby is uh, Stukov, Anna. He's very good on these two. And maybe, yeah, maybe oh. Deckard is one of them as well. Like, he, he is one yeah. of the best NA supports, actually, Hebby. Really? Yeah. I have no idea. I think. Uh, yeah, no, he is actually. He's, he's very solid, I think. He was uh, the sixth player for crowd control last season, so he he got to play once, I believe. Like they they had him subbed him once, but mm. uh, I remember him from in houses, and uh, yeah, he actually oh God. always Switch played very solid. So Chromi Uthabans Medif is in, but I don't expect the Koreans to play Medif here. Mm. Oh, Johanna first! Oh yeah, 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 I not a big fan of. That. <laughs> It may open as well. Yeah. I wonder what they're thinking there. Because all the NA teams, and I've seen this Vince guy as well. I'm pretty sure he played May quite a bit. Um, I don't remember if he played it yesterday. No, Johanna on Tomb doesn't sound that bad. I mean, it's true. But yeah, just, um, <laughs> look look what the, what the other get in return, right? Yeah, I mean, it's this guy's... I think it was Uki's team that I saw this from the most, like the, the Sonya Hogger Pryo 
uh, and he heard it from other NA people. I mean, well. they are onto something, right? Like in, we kind of in yeah. Europe, like we see it as well now more and more. Like uh, these two heroes are for sure very overstated, I think. But uh, at the same time, yeah, I'm, no, go I'm, ahead, go ahead. I'm not sure if Sonya on, on this map. I'm not sure if the Sonya is for actually. Like I liked our opening with the Rexar. Uh, Rexar Hogger. I like that way more than the. It was into Sonya. Yeah. So maybe you can wait with the offlaner. But yeah. I feel like Sonya, if both teams play equally well, the Sonya has a very hard time on this map. And yeah, the Tychus is picked, which is good into both these heroes. Duku can also punish, and is also like one of Hyde's better heroes, I think. On e pink. Yes, 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 yes. He's a. Like I think he got pretty tilted playing <laughs> Lucio, even though he won the game yesterday, like he got charged and taunted so many times and if he had no ping there, like there's, uh, he boops every time. Yes, I think so. I yeah, remember yeah. playing against him. Yeah, just, yeah. It must be very tilting, getting hit by that. <clears throat> yeah, I wanted to say about the Johanna, like I don't think you have to first pick her, I think you get her down the line actually, if you, if that's really the hero you want. The only argument then is, well, all the other first picks are not much better either, so you might as well just pick Johanna, I guess, but... Victory Sylvanas for, for Mokka. Oh, no. Rip. Someone... <laughs> it was a Korean. Someone DC'd. They did lock their heroes, at least. The Sylvanas Brightwing, so I guess they can return from there, but... No. Mokka, by the way, is Sylvana's main, and he got the hero. And you mentioned it earlier, NA people really like the hero. And he's pretty good at it, so... Might be popping yeah. off. True, true. <clears throat> yeah, I think regarding Johanna as well, like... Uh, I think the... It's like... The... You don't show anything from your draft, right? Like, if they went to Tychus first pick, maybe they wouldn't have gone... Sonya Hogger, and... If they think they're like, okay, they pick those heroes and then they kind of get a counter pick by picking Tychus Stukov, then they're they're getting what they want, even though the Johanna might look weird. Yeah. Or like, then they still get, I mean, if that's what they're thinking. Or maybe they're just picking heroes. Maybe they're going Asmodan on Johanna or something. I mean, yeah, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of Asmodan. Okay. Uh, the Russian, like, Ash won two maps against the yeah. Gorex with Asmodan. So. <laughs> the only one with Asmodan. Yeah. So it seemed quite OP, actually. <laughs> I mean, that's why I will never stop banning Volskaya, because as soon as we play that map, someone's going to play Asmodan and then ignore objective and just, like... Oh, trade. my God, yeah. yeah I actually quite... had a Storm League game. Uh, it was against Mene. Mene played Asmodan oh today. Oh, my God. Yeah, I mean, I saw Mene and... streaming today. <laughs> He got nano boosted and then ult, did the ult. I'm not sure if it gives damage to them though. I don't know. Yeah. I saw him on Falstad <laughs> in Gul'dan. He yeah. played Cubil Falstad. He won the game, but he kept saying it feels really bad. Like yeah. it's dog shit. And then the next game he played Gul'dan and it was terrible. Like he didn't finish <laughs> his stacks on level one. Like oh, no. getting farmed <laughs> on cooldown. <laughs> yeah. Men are getting farmed is not a good combination yeah. for his mental health. Yeah. It's like the number one player were like getting tilted when the worst players kill him. <laughs> <laughs> it really gets to him. It's very personal for him, I think. Yeah. 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 <laughs> oh, yeah, they were doing the entire draw. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's fast. I mean, they might also have to swap. Like, keep in mind, not everyone has all heroes because true, there's true. Koreans and Europeans and stuff, so. Sometimes, yeah. Wait, what was the ban? The, uh, Kettle is asking, what did we ban, guys? Okay, Leoric. Yeah, I actually don't remember. What <laughs> <laughs> so Sylvana's Brightwing is next, and then, the yeah. Time. Come on, Mokka, wake up. It's your turn. There we go. Victory for the Forsaken. So KP gets to choose his range carry. Whatever he wants here. Yeah? I think they might go Rexar now. The J guy plays it for sure. Yeah. And then ranged, what looks good. Kinda like... Okay, it's deeper actually. Oh. 
And Mephisto? He has an insane Mephisto, by the way. Really? Yes. Oh. Like when they played, when there was like this Korean tournament, right? And when KP, like, they actually just picked Mephisto and he was fucking 1v9. Like maybe on ping it's a different story, but I think it's one of his prime heroes actually. Yeah, I it mean, might I think be... it's one of the heroes better. Like, I mean, it's not that bad on ping probably. Yeah, I, I, I would think the same actually, yeah. Ah, uh, we are, might we might be in for a treat here if KP manages to pop off. Like it might be the Mephisto show. I kind of like yeah. to see it, like we don't, like sometimes it pops, uh, like sometimes we see Mephisto picks, but not too much. And I actually think the hero is not that bad. Yeah, uh, every time I see it, it looks pretty strong. Yeah. So maybe we should stop playing Mephisto. Actually, yeah, the QP uh, Twitch emotes are Mephisto ones, I think. <laughs> so. Oh. We should play some Mephisto? Maybe. I kind of like playing the hero, but... We need we need to get Nick on something that wave clears then. Or a Nick plays Mephisto, but I think he does not. I mean I guess you can learn it. Play Stormly so much. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Probably fun playing something new. Yeah. Nick was good on Samuro, he plays PvE only. Yeah, he did actually. He can definitely change gears if he has to. <laughs> I mean looking at game one and game three, like Nick Nick's gameplay was like uh, 180 turn, <laughs> and then it was the rest of us that like played uh, clean first game and then entered. The <laughs> yeah, yeah, we entered. The, yeah, down the Actually, road, yeah, it right got over. to us. <laughs> yeah. We had to take over the road. Mm. Yeah, I think with the Mephisto, the Diva makes more sense um, than a Rexa. Not sure if I think it's better. I don't like the Varian into this actually. I mean, that, and that's me like <laughs> not liking Varian. Uh, yeah, I that's quite. It, uh... it, I mean, it's decent into Johanna for the shield break. Oh, fast guns actually take a lot. Uh, it's actually interesting. Kettle uh, has a very different approach uh, to play Varian compared to you. Like he's always gonna go yeah, to yeah. W on one, and he's gonna he goes take. For the... I mean, that's that's the straightforward Varian, right? Like you charge, you taunt, you look for kill. Yeah. And the reason why I think that build is worse is because it's so telegraphed. Like, you can, if you play that build, you can only do you only do one thing pretty much. Well, the way I play it is you continuously CC them and then you taunt them when it actually matters instead yeah. of just at the start of the fight. Uh, and in some games, I mean, the, maybe the his build is, is better. So just taunt. Ooh, them much fancy pants fucked up big time. Oi, ay, ay. Yeah. Did he miss his spin? Uh, he cancelled? No, he cancelled it. Oh, he cancelled it. I think so, at least. Maybe it was misaligned anyway, so he would have spinned into the fourth, <laughs> but... Well, yeah. Oh, well, they did get the easy camp first. XP yeah. Should have been no kills, though. Them. I think he should have just casually walked out and yeah, they had the yeah, easy yeah. camp, but... And you're getting to level 4 without any problem. Well, the Varian gets pulled freely. Ah, uh, the level but 1 Hogger is a red card because he's 4 man and he doesn't go W stacking. Maybe, yeah. Uh... Uki red carded already? No, no Uki is on Sonya, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's probably uh, tilting as well. <laughs> he's like, oh no. <laughs> but that's actually the talent Uki usually picks, but I'm not sure if he picks. Probably not if he would be 4 man. Yeah. They're yeah, both hard camps meeting. Silv team will have a favorite favor if it reaches the wall, but right now, I might even bomb this. Yeah, it's working up for it. Work very oh, deep, he goes though. very deep with the bomb. The tower's yeah, actually aggro him, but uh, no one. Either. Yeah, no one turned on him. But uh, yeah, neither camp really did anything. Force the bomb. XP completely equal. Uh, maybe a little bit push for the blue team, but nothing. Nothing too important. They get in 20 gems on Jana though, which is kind of the most important to get it off your main tank, because then she can zone afterwards. Yeah. That is true. Varian charged. Taking a decent amount of damage. the bigger the ore chunk, and after that they didn't have enough damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, I, I mean, I was saying for the Varian before, like, he... He's good into Johanna in this game, but I don't think he's good into any of the other. Ty Tychus is good 
into if he doesn't go the sh protector, which I hope he doesn't. On level ten? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, he does a hundred percent. Really? I think so. Him? Yeah. I think I've seen him take the charge. Okay. Uh, but I've seen him take the protector as well, so that's why I'm a bit. Come scared. on, Uki slam! Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Getting the mech out of the way. Uh, I mean, I guess we will see at level ten, but yeah. I, I think he's gonna go the the shield wall or whatever it's gonna call it, uh, how it's yeah. called. Right, Eva gets in the gems as well, no one here to stall anything. Wait, the Hogger has super grief build, no? D on... D on 7, but not D on 1. Uh, looks a little bit uh, The D on 7... I guess it slows a bit. Reduces cooldown by 2 seconds, not nothing. And deals a little bit of damage, but... That's very strange. I mean, that's, that's the talent you went at the very beginning, Uki but they did nerf it. Uki gets. Oh, uh... Wait, oh he's my burning, God. but he gets out, yeah. That is so lucky, actually. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine the way we. Yeah. He trusted. Cattle getting spo spotted out. Yeah, the loot team control in this game pretty decently so far. Yeah, I no, I'm not even. I mean, uh, honestly, it's Johanna wave clear. They just uh, run from A to B. Mm. Yeah, they don't have to do much. Else. Yeah. And they're getting like limited as well. Kippy taking a bit of damage. Kippy didn't know. go the level 4 shield, he went the globe instead. Yeah. This fine. Not gonna co be able to completely one deny later, but at the same time. I mean, Tomb is probably the map where you catch the most globes, like uh, running around. I don't I don't even know what the globe action, uh, talent action does. Yeah, uh, it gives him, bounce, uh, right? when you pick up the globe, uh, the I think the effect is uh, longer lasting, the, the mana HP, and you get yeah. CDR on your basic abilities okay. while the globe is ticking. I don't know the exact numbers though, like, don't ask me. But then it's like more offensive than the shield. The shield is like, like uh, I mean, team fights, unkillable, I guess. But yeah. In rotations, you will have more combos with this and yes, more Yes, combo. yes, yeah. And yeah, the red team almost good. Oh! <laughs> oh! He couldn't also no. take him and now he's gonna die for it, I think. Yeah. Uh, oh! Uh, uh, Kegwait! Kegwait? Wow. <laughs> nice uh, Bless Shield uh, to peel there. What's that the uh, level 4 talent globe? Uh, no, I don't <laughs> think there was any globe involved. <laughs> and actually, if you had the shield, <laughs> he would have gotten a very big one, but... Yep. Uh. Okay, so you are right. Kettle went the, the level 10 uh, charge. And actually, Jana just dies here. Big spin. No yes, ultimate was used. They just casually killed her. Yeah. And Diva <laughs> had to pop her bomb uh, in Africa. That is a very... Very good start to this push, after the siege. Yeah, maybe the hogger build this 5 head. Maybe. You are getting pretty sure. They have leap. If if Diva drops out of her mech... Okay, never mind. It's too greedy. Just get bottom 4. Sivana's already pushed it out. Very nice uh, macro here. They got top wall, mid wall and bottom 4. And actually, yeah. maybe they can collapse here with a bright wing Z. Onto the rotation, uh, yes! And hide actually, wait. Hide the one that gets uh, left on. No. Yeah. Uh, by actually, by both uh, Sonya and Hogger. Ooh, KP, look at him. Getting the gems. Smart. Smart. I mean, the, if the red team's next pay, if they get all forts and like get a huge lead from it, then might be hard for the blue team to come back. But. I do think they are outscaling the blue. Like the blue team is outscaling with the Mephisto and Tychus, like probably. Yeah. And Hog Hogger didn't go W build, so it's like a bit less impactful later, I feel like. They have another payment and a hard cam lined up. <clears throat> the red team, that is. Level 13 is also actually not that much closer, but they will get it before. The bot weaver is in a really shitty position though. It's like completely yeah, left alone. That for a long time. Yeah. It, 
This is getting very clear as well. Can't be actually doing a lot of work here. But the only yeah, they have no good uh, answer to um, Mephisto when oh, he is in. Oh, uh, he, he lives? One HP? No, he's dead. Can't be actually destroying them right now. Hogger is taking a lot of damage, but doesn't go down. Right Sonya is still in fire. trouble, yeah. Yeah, she's getting slowed. And she should go down here. Although hide on the backside. Yeah, they actually... They're scared of the collapse. And meanwhile... The boy weavers are actually doing work. Oh, no, they're like us. Good. They're like the Hados. Keep chasing and then they yeah. die. <laughs> oh no. Maybe KP yeah, can clean up. He got some more gems. Maybe he gets cleaned up. No, Hyde is there to be a... The only reason they die is because they were like indecisive. Because they're like, okay, we need to back and defend. Because they would have killed Sonya, I think, if they just kept running at her. Yeah. But they were like, oh no, they're flanking. Then, I mean, honestly, oh, no, D-pushing was good as well though, right? Top keep wall, bottom yeah. keep wall, like both of them uh, fucking... Yeah, they, after the Varian kill and yeah. the hog... Oh, maybe it was only Varian? Then they should have instantly D-pushed for sure. But uh, they could have... If they were just more decisive what they did, I think it would have been better. Yeah. I mean, for a team that plays without <laughs> communication, <laughs> I guess it kind of yeah. worked out. It wasn't too bad. I mean, looking at the game now, sure. Red team ahead in structures, they will get the midfoot probably. But the uh, gems, I mean. I mean, what's their second payment? Much all yeah. yeah, exactly, so they. And the XP is fine. Flash shield is up, they pause the game just when Johanna walks up there. Uh, <clears throat> Mephisto, Mephisto Globe Talent is 150% uh, increased duration for Globes and every Globe tick procs your trade. Okay. So I, yeah, kind of what I said. Uh, it increases the duration of the Globe and then gives you CDR. I just didn't know the numbers. <laughs> Pretty interesting. I wonder if it stacks if you get double Globe or if it's like... Extend duration or twice the cooldown at the same time, if you understand what I mean? I think the answer is the second globe just refreshes, like, it just counts from there on, I think. Extend duration, stub finger says. Yeah. CDR okay. is the same, but the duration increases, yeah. Oh, I hear sounds, but I don't see the game. Okay, there we go. Flash oh, shield was the... used, actually. That's the pause <laughs> I was talking about, bro. Yeah, it happened. <laughs> it happened, in actually. Leap. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it happened, actually. Instant leap. Yeah, it happened, actually. Varen's pretty deep now, though. Can he go down? Big goals from KP. They're actually almost falling, but nothing seems to be going down yet. Yeah. Taunt used again. Hold on to D.Va, though. That's yeah. a bit ambitious. And now they're actually kind of dying. Look at height. He's... More? Frontlining <laughs> this to come. Oh no. Can everyone so tap close. the moon well? Yes. Running it. Might have to bomb here soon. Can he? Oh, fancy pants. He spins in and Good I bomb. think. Oh, uh, he's good. He's good. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no, Kippy. <laughs> oh, Kippy. Living Kippy on the edge here. I mean, that was kind of lucky, no? But yeah, it was 1 HP. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> there was no oh, way he knew he would get out of there. But they do get the pain out of the blue team, and they clear out the waves. Pretty... I mean... Completely even game, honestly. Uh, I like it. And But the problem is now for the red team, 16, Mephisto gets more insane. Taiko is more insane. I wonder what he skills on 16 actually, right? I, I, I didn't see his 13 either right now, but maybe he has yeah. uh, his own approach. He uh, probably takes the percentage damage right versus this. I think so, but we'll see. Because he's getting a lot of resets. Oh. He has decent positioning here, but... Big blast, slow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Has to jump out, actually. Yeah, Silence was used just to survive as well. Oh, no. Right wing Zeus on Hogger, who's eeing out. And now on top, Vari the Mephisto ult. Yeah, Varian's so tanky, though. <laughs> yeah, true. He doesn't die from that. If the Tychus was drilling him meanwhile, probably, but... Yeah, he already was an Odin. Yeah, I think he was mounted up. Okay, they get one foot. I mean, if they just actually get these kills, the game would be so different. No, this is too... Couldn't see what talent it took him. 
Uki taking a lot of damage, and actually, after, and it's the Q on Mephisto. I saw some explosions. I think. Okay. The Q on the green. Unless I mistake. Yeah, yeah, no, I think I saw it as well. Yeah. Uh, Uki okay, a little bit number. too aggressive there, but Hyde also hitting his uh, W and then the root. Yep, yep, yep. Punishing and him. Didn't have a up, I guess. Yeah. And this is. Uh... Uh, do they start the uh, hard camp, the blue team? They're actually looking for the invade. I oh, yeah. kinda like this, actually. Hyde is, uh, he's going in, guys. He's like, my camp. Oh, oh yeah, they can't steal it, though. Okay. He's gonna it's ping his team. It's unfortunate that Johanna was the l last yeah. one to pay. Yeah. So no one could walk up. I mean, I don't think the camp matters, but if they manage to get a kill there, which I think Hyde was looking for by, like, keeping them there, then, uh, then it would have been, like, very bad for the red team, right? Yeah. Like, one dead. Where we were pushing in. And probably if you kill one, you probably also steal the camp because it means yeah. they are still on the spot. Johanna. Yes, Oh, sure. she actually just explodes. Yeah. Hoi, yo, yo. That's oh, the, yeah. the shield breaker, right? On third. Yeah. Or maybe she didn't even manage to press anything. I mean, probably shield breaker, but she doesn't have the level 1D, so the shield is quite small. Yeah. It was mo more so the blue team showing on the side waves and walking up the. And it was good CC chain, like everyone, like the Polymorph, yeah, sure. Sonya Q, like everyone had uh, his button ready. Varian might actually... Oh, the, if that hits Brightwing. Taunt is up, we might look for something soon. Taunt on Stuko. Actually, drops very oh low here. God. Gets out. Yeah, but they have to back now. Soon the side laners will collapse. Was it important kind of kill, a wasted though? pay. Yeah, yeah, yeah the kill it's... makes the pay kind of wasted. So now, there will probably be a fight. Okay, it seems like the blue team might just choose to give the pay. Giving the, given that they're rotating so many people both sides. Or Johanna's just gonna stall and die. Ah, uh, yeah, maybe she, yeah, I wanted to say stall and die, yeah. cause we just saw her exploding. Oh, yeah, that was the shield breaker. I have one out to like, boop. <clears throat> I don't show you the talents, bro. My hands are in the air. It's a clean feed. Oh, lead Tychus. onto Tychus. I'm Hogger deep now, but I can't really get him. It's fine though, yeah. I think there was a 75 spell armor maybe by Tychus. Because you they didn't fight now. Wait, the red team is in there. Sonya went up, but when Varian went in, but the blue team didn't try to do anything. Yeah, Bless Shield on cooldown. It's kind of rough, right? Janna is <laughs> it's not the best at forcing a fight. Yep, yep. Odin was popped aggressively here. No one is. Wait, hold up, Jana! She just gets farmed, actually. <laughs> okay, Benny, it's time to. Do... Actually, no one picks Jana anymore in Europe. But I want to say it's time to pick uh, yeah, Shield Break. <laughs> I mean, if you have uh, the damage for it, then uh, it's for sure good. Hogar, Sonya, Savannah, I guess they have the damage for it. I think it's also Polymorph 16, the armor reduction, right? It's a massive yeah. uh, power spike. But it's more so... Oh, KP stuck? In the wall? Uh, maybe Hogger is stuck! Oh no. Oh my god! Oh, um, KP with the 5000 IQ uh, aim! But is, me is he alive? Yeah, he's oh alive. My god, yeah. And the cleanup? What oh the fuck? I can't believe this. KP is going. Wow. Wait, this is the comeback that you can see Vana style as well? Oh my god! Wow, oh. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, okay, KP, calm down. And somehow Tychus didn't die either. Hyde yeah, made sure to <laughs> save him. But this both and pushing with this boss, they actually might be able to end, honestly. Is quite an early boss, but Odin might have bomb up and Tychus 20. Like, I feel the if the blue team can kind of engage first or counter engage before someone gets one shot, then they for sure win. Wait, they have Crater? Sorry, I didn't see that. Sonia oh, with <laughs> Okay, yellow <card. laughs> I guess it helps uh, getting the Johanna kill, but after that, then what? Then they die. Wait, I what like did he skill on 20? Did he skill the silence on 20, Mephisto? Because he doesn't have Mimic. No. Yeah, I guess he did. I mean, he hit every like single that. ult, I think. It's kind of crazy. Um, almost every single ult. I mean, look at this, the full HP boss. 
and, um, I think it's they don't have enough people. Leap did nothing. Oh no, the crater and is gonna cock block yourself. Yeah, I mean, look at Kip. <laughs> he just won me nice. Yeah, Ogre gets stunned by the uh, boss. Oh my, look. Ah, okay, we play my first. <laughs> <laughs> How is this guy doing this with 190 ping? <laughs> Oh, there we go, an old mist, but the core is more than that. Actually, yeah, pretty insane comeback. Like, I don't even know if it was a comeback. Like, Jana was the only one kind of getting yeah, farmed, yeah, yeah. but the rest of the team looked very clean. But it was exactly the same as my, I mean, yeah? my games against them, kind of. It was, I mean, the red team didn't have as much of an advantage as I did yesterday, but it was the same. They just kept playing the game, and then late game, they just won. <laughs> True. Was, yeah. Uh, to, I mean, Hogga went very deep though for Mephisto, right? Like, yes, he was kind of stuck in the yeah. wall, but uh, he went very deep for it, and then... It was the trying to solo play. Yeah, and then it started escalating. I'm gonna... Sh wait, what talents does he have on 20? Mimic? So he has the shade thingy on 20. That's, oh. I've never seen someone Drop skilling locations. a bit. Yeah. And you get all level 7 talents, which is pretty good, actually. Level 7 talents are really strong. Like you get armor. He had he picked the move speed. Yeah, he picked the move speed, and then and when then he, he gets skills the twenty, he gets all of them and armor yeah. as well. Um, the slow is actually really strong, I think. But you don't want. I mean, you want the move speed as well. But I wonder if he did any. I didn't see if he did any like swaps with it actually. Um, I mean, I would have to watch the replay, I guess, to see that. Yeah, pay attention to him, but. But wait. <sighs> How does it even work, actually? You use your E, and then... You have an activatable, and uh, then you press your activatable, and you, you spawn on the... No, wait, you spawn where your shade is, right? So you bounce back? And you it refreshed the duration, yeah. I guess that's how it works, yeah. Huh. So as soon as it's about to go out... But then you don't, like, E in offensively the same way? Or the, it's like super commitment, right? Because like, okay, you're in your team, you e forward, yeah, and then if you press that, I mean, you will go back to your team again, yeah, and then when that ends, you will go back into their team. <laughs> so it's like, yeah, but then I guess you probably have another one. I guess keep jumping. I guess actually, I, I guess, I yeah, <laughs> I, I guess. It's. Uh... I mean, he definitely eat into them at the end. like, right? He kept eating for like he just. Yeah, I mean, yeah, maybe yeah. he didn't use the 20 active actually. Maybe he skilled it for having all the benefits of the level 7s. I don't know. But he, uh, I mean, he played it very aggressively. He kept eating in. Yeah, I mean, maybe maybe this guy's onto something. Who knows? I mean, he definitely has like his own talent choices, right? On Tassada as well, level 4 E and level 20 wall. Like, we kind of saw he has a little bit of a different approach. Uh, first, uh, first pick to Hanna's busted. Don't you usually take the uh, Eon 4, actually? Uh, I no, I think the to... Eon 4 is really good. The only other talent that competes with it is the shield. Like the... You get oh, a, yeah, you get yeah, a yeah. shield when you uh, have your passive I think charge. the force wall... The force wall is insane on 4. Yeah. Even if you don't go to 20, but especially with the 20. Yeah. He does have a spell power talent on 20 though, so I would pick that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. True. It's a pretty good one, gives, actually. Yeah, it gives your whole team 20% spell power. It's actually insane. Permanently. Permanently, If it's yeah. like close to them. Hmm. Right, it was a pretty a decent zero. game, though, right? Like, no, we didn't see too much uh, rundowns or Clown Fiesta. It was actually a pretty decent game. No. Yeah. Yeah. I mean... I kind of like their... Up the, into the Sonya Hogger. Like... I think the Mephisto actually made a lot of sense later into that. I wonder how much they thought of that beforehand. But he, Tyke's like he Mephisto, he does yeah. a lot of damage safely, and I mean if they try to go on him, he can jump around. They're gonna be grouped up, and it's very likely that like even if he dies, he gets enough damage done, as long as he doesn't get completely one shot. But he wasn't even the target in the fight. And... No, exactly, and I think that's kind of the draft. They don't really. They can't really target him with what they have. They have yeah, uh, yeah. no Junkrat Boob, no Cocoon, no... Like, no, none of the abilities work very well against his Shade. So you would have to brute force him, I think. 
uh, on the shade position, but yeah, they, I mean, they, I mean, they just killed Johanna instead, I guess. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> the Johanna was just a bait all along. She was a bait, yeah. Sometimes Actually, she got bless shield off and it was good enough. Yeah, Johanna gets engaged, she presses her W, <laughs> and then even if he dies, she groups them all up for the Mephisto, <laughs> yeah. and like silence from uh, Stukov. Stukov, yeah. Honestly, the more I think about it, the draft was kind of five head. <laughs> well, I kind of like it. Looks like second map will be Battlefield. No, fuck. Not battle. <laughs> <sighs> Why do everyone want to play this map, actually? Yeah. I mean, I'm not the biggest fan either, right? I personally prefer, like, tomb towers, uh, shrines. Yeah. <clears throat> but... Same. Actually, I like Dragon Shire a lot, but uh, I like it not as much when Muradin is worse now, but I used to like it a lot. Because Muradin and Anub were like always my most played tanks, kind of, and yeah. uh, they were very strong on that map. That's true, they are both very good. It felt so good just jumping over the like uh, bot side wall and hitting the stun <laughs> at the gate and then just kill the guy. So, do we see Liming first pick here again? Uh, we might, right? Uh, uh, yeah, Mokka got the place at Vanas though. Yeah, else, right? so and Uki has have to play go double rain. Sonya or Hogger. Yeah. Huh, let's see. I don't know if he plays uh, Rexar actually. Mm, not sure. And uh, maybe we will see a Rexar from the J guy this time. I actually think that guy might be very underrated. Like, or maybe it's just me not knowing of him, but I'm very impressed by the J guy so far, actually. Ah, he looks pretty solid, yeah. Team. And he also plays like all the cancer picks, literally all of them. <laughs> <laughs> Which does a lot for your offlane to do. Like, imagine like you played Viking instead, but Chris also played all of these heroes and some were. Yeah, yeah. We, yeah but we, we got Hunt somewhere right now, it. it's not too bad. Yeah. Yeah, and I mean, luckily it works completely fine. I mean, <laughs> honestly, Chris is probably better on the ranged and Nick the melees. Um, so it uh, it works fine that well. Yeah, honestly. actually, I think uh, it's not not too big of an issue for us if we have like to swap around <laughs> for a game. Chris plays way more like uh, safe in a way. Like he never really ends when he plays a range. On range, yeah, that's true. On melee, sometimes he goes a bit deep, but on range, I feel like he's uh, always like be where he should be. Uh, never, never really anything. <laughs> Unlike a hunt. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but Nick also one v nines very often, guys. Don't forget. Yeah. That. Yeah, that's the that's the trade off. <laughs> like you don't make Stuka. the flashy play. Stuka first pick actually. Dealing it. Yeah, stealing it away, but... Luke, you're gone. Huh. I mean, Hyde I... played uh, Brightwing yesterday as well. Yeah, yeah. Maybe he plays Monk. It's like, that's always a Korean pick, but maybe it's awkward on ping. It's not that best thing to stuck either. And that's the Liming <laughs> Diablo. Liming Diablo, okay. The Diablo is... The Vince guy actually played it quite a bit, I remember. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, it's a comfort pick, and it's pretty good into Liming. Like, uh, the nice, like, he's pretty hard to kill because he probably goes into Liming, he would go like the spell shield W. Actually, build. I think last week Vince played Diablo almost every game, no? Like, I remember yeah, him yeah, in yeah. the last free agent tournament. I think, actually, on this map, he uh, in the last free agent tournament, he played Diablo and they had. Uh, him and Gottfilf was like, and there was a Samuro as well. I remember, they had like Genji Samuro. Wasn't it Jay? Jay who played the Samuro? Yeah, <coughs> yeah, he played Samuro, but yeah. Gottfilf played Genji, and they were like just killing people everywhere. <laughs> Uki got the Sonya. Yeah, and uh, again, I Tigers. don't, I don't feel it's the best Sonya map. I feel like Sonya without triple melee is a bit awkward on a lot of maps. Uh, but they might but still go triple melee, no? Fancy pants. Yeah. Might pick I, guess, I guess they could... Which one though? 
then they have Sonya racing, Tychus fighting. I guess it's fine. Mm. What do you ban here? Do you try to outban Hyde by banning right do, wing? Yeah. yeah, they actually do the ban the right wing. What's left? I mean, Malf. <laughs> I mean, he plays yeah. all the supports, right? I think like Malf, uh, Monk. Uh... Yeah, but maybe he doesn't own them on A. <laughs> <laughs> I remember him on Anduin as well, so he definitely. I don't think he mines too much. But uh, yeah, it's true. Maybe <laughs> someone has to swap for him. Rexa, you called for it, and uh, Macurion, yeah. Grant us strength. I mean, the Malf level 1 is still insane. Like, I think Yasu had the uh, insane route today as well. Um, and it gives permanent mana to Liming as well, and it's cooldown reduction. Yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty the, solid. The D on Malf is uh, very oh, yeah. underrated. Like, yeah, it's you very strong. Move, but it gives a lot of DPF to yes. carry. Hanzo and Anubarak. Diablo can melt this game. Yes, yes. Even yeah. with the spell shield build, he probably dies. If they get their things on him. Gray yeah, yeah, Diablo might just uh, explode. Greymane. Koreans always pretty like favorite Greymane, I remember. It's, uh, it's like their, their Raynor kind of. Kippy really likes Reyna as well though, but uh, yeah, I yeah, guess... Yeah, but Reyna is more of a target versus this kind of die, I think. Yeah. Graham is more mobile and he can also actually dive and kill people. Whereas the Reyna will just sh sit and shoot. <laughs> That's true. Uh, we don't see too much Grayman anymore, like very rarely actually he gets picked. I still kind of like him as well, but... Uh, Every time I mention him, Chris gets very angry and he's like, ah, the hero's dog shit. I'm not sure. I think Nick doesn't like Rayman, guys. I think he's not a big fan of it. For battle, no, I didn't I didn't talk about level 1 D talent. I just meant D in general is good for, for Ming on Malf. I said before, the level 1 Malf sleep is insane. Nick likes ETC. Yeah, Benny likes ETC. Nick not so much. I think he really ha actually he really hates the cow. Never allows to. I mean, never allows us like, to pick it. ETC and Johan are like by themselves. They're for sure the most useless tanks. <laughs> <laughs> like they don't do any damage. They're like all they do is set things up for the team. Johanna have wave clear. ETC more engage. But that's all they have. But I'm actually kind of beginning to see the potential of ETC a bit more. I think he I I really like the I think the hero is fine and I'm ready yeah. if like we we tried ETC right and honestly we threw the game I think ETC was absolutely fine that game. Yeah. Like I yes agree. we lost with it but uh, we probably shouldn't have lost. I'm ready for uh, a little uh, like more uh, more ETC attempts. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, I'm gonna play it a bit more <laughs> comfortable. Anup should try to block, yeah. Okay, now he does it, like he walks into Liming. I think he should have done that already, but... Because she had a pretty good position to poke them. And I don't think she should be allowed to, because... Yeah, actually she now she swaps uh, to top side. Actually, she hits a big one onto Tychus, but... Diablo got engaged at the same time. I didn't go for the spell shield, actually. The Diablo? Yeah. yeah. When I see this level 1 talent, I would hope he goes out attack build, but uh, I don't know. Oh! Hoi, oh, 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 Hanzo, but uh, Mokka dies, gives a reset. KP is done as well. Yeah, I guess he got slowed by Stuko after. Yeah, like you know? Diablo is so weak there, like on the on the bottom brawl fight. Like, I don't think he can do much. Oh, hide. Wait. Might actually be fine. Yeah, the sleep. 
I never waited with the Q and he, he silenced the gate instead he, of he, yeah, yeah, he waited very long with his Q. I mean, he did hit it, but he also managed, like, mouth pressed buttons because of it. Yeah. Alt E, Alt E, the, <laughs> <laughs> the most effective way to play Malf. And uh, yeah, Stukov uh, entered his uh, E to follow up. W going W build, same still. I think. I'm, I'm not sure why he doesn't pick spell shield with it. Like, even though they have Tychus, they have a lot of magic damage. Sonya, and Hanzo, yeah. I mean, Stuko even as well. And Tychus as well, like, outside of D, it's like only magic damage. Yeah, sure. Um, and this level 1 on Diablo is just so useless. <laughs> it's very, very unimpactful, actually. But uh, a lot of people pick it. I shall purge your evil from this land, demon. Mm, Hanzo had to base, so he's a bit late. Okay, he's gonna he's gonna be here. But uh Greyman is already racing all that time. Yeah. And if he manages to melee the boss actually Greyman takes a lot of damage here, but it gets out. Huge sleep! Look yeah, at yeah, that. Yeah. Oh. oh you're a bit ahead of me. Uh, I'm at 28, 29, 30... Okay, I'm a bit ahead. <laughs> okay. 34, so. Yeah, the, the sleep was insane by height. Yeah, Grimmin got out, but I mean, the blue team is super ahead now. Like, they got the raise, and they got the pick up. Yeah, if Grimmin can freely hit the boss, it's like so good. Like, he has such high DPS on the boss, like if he can yeah, warm yeah. form it. Anup went very deep to start the fight, like onto the grey main. And then I guess yeah. Hyde smurfed the, the route, like, honestly, on the, the whole back line. Yeah, it hit three people like this thing. Yeah. Somehow. I think they just stood in it and let it spread, honestly, because they didn't stand <laughs> in the tank plane. So KPS level 4 mana, level 7 range, yeah, looks kind of standard. Level 4 talent is kind of flexible. He went for the one where you never run out of mana. I think that's fine. I think, uh, I think Nick likes Draymond. As, like if you play for the just range form and then at 30 move speed and just play around the Draymond. Yeah. Uh, but uh, most people don't do that, so he doesn't like it. <laughs> and maybe he thinks it kind of uses pre-13 compared to like a Draymond or something. Yeah, it's it's tr if you want to play like that, 13 is very important. You need the move speed. And, then and you if you want to play like that, then Rainer is kind of better as well. As if, like, yeah. As if you what you do. The can engage more, but you don't need to engage to like, win. He can bait more cooldowns though, Anu? Rayman maybe. Anu, Anu went very deep and again, yeah. Oh, he didn't hit the wall stun. Uh, I didn't see when Diablo used the E. Maybe he used the E. That was a very 5 head route by Hyde just now. Like he yeah. anticipated Anubarak would go on to KP. So he just rooted in front of the Grey main. Yeah. Uh, I have to be right back first. Yeah. Fort is kinda gone on bottom, like one limbing combo. He gets the camp. Maybe they can kill Misha here. Oh, yes. Yeah, half a level down though. It's probably like the bottom easy camp is gonna deny them experience though. Like the the Korean team or also oh, oh can't really soak bottom right now, which is a bit of a problem for them. And we see Uki freezing the lane actually, or letting the minions die before he interacts with the camp. First bullet on Grey Main. Disintegrate on uh, Li Ming. Anticipating the cocoon. Bullet and Anubarak gets. He gets one shot. 
took them. Uh, took them a little bit, but. Misha stun, Malf root, cursed bullet, and then Diablo was kind of late actually to the party, but. Uh, honestly, if Misha stuns you like that and you get Malf rooted, it's already a big problem. Man, this is a full shieldy model. This might be a 2-0 actually. Like this game uh, looks very grim. Uki is flanking. He has leap. Arrow! Oh no. Arrow didn't hit. We are in trouble. First bullet didn't hit. I think Sonya has to go bottom. She goes now. I think they saved the keep, and that's why I said I think she can go to bottom. Uh, it could escalate though if. No, it won't escalate. Cocoon still up. Arrow 20 seconds. Sonya is here, but you can't really, uh, you can't really look like that. Mm. Zuri sniffed her out. Easy camp is spawning. The goat man. Look, Hyde is pinging himself. He's like, guys, please. Can one of you help me out here? Hanzo is bit. Okay, Sonya is basing. There we go. Actually, the game is salvageable for uh, what will Mokka do. It looks kind of shit, but they they will get level 13. But they need they need a kill or win one team fight, right? They can't be uh, getting bullied around anymore. But they kinda cut the losses. Like it's it's okay. It's not good. We lost both forts, but we will get level 13 for the next objective phase. We can play the game. Lina is cleaning up. Uh, she definitely has permission for that. Uh, level 12.9. One more minion wave will make it. No! Anubarak! No! Oh, he gets out. And he gets out because Diablo was late again to the punish. Just like before. This time Anub lives. 12.9. 12.9. There we go. 13. Okay, this is our moment. Can we kill Misha? Yes. I have uh, picked up the dog, so I'm holding the dog now. The dog What's happening? Yes. Um, they got level 13. Yeah. Anu and dies, so does Greyman. I guess that's what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> Diablo is going very deep for his Duko. Oh, but he's completely isolated. I'm close to Lemming, though. One more auto. Oh, oh Hanzo! Eh? Oh, no! Not like this! Eh? <laughs> oh, no. and then the Mal flips oh! as well. Come on, the grenade, wait, wait, wait. mine! What the? Oh! And, and now they oh, die. No. Okay, that that's pink. Actually, I know Fancy Pants is NA, but that's uh, that was a hundred percent pink. <laughs> that was uh, disgusting to see everyone on one HP living, oh, and then the tiger no. dies. That's a fucking. Hey, thing hold up! This hard camp invade, though. I'm not sure about that. I mean, the camp is kind of free. It's four versus three. But I don't know if it does anything. Is it free? I mean, it should be free. They have cocoon, bro. Yeah. I guess Anu. It's just okay. I mean, I don't think he can do anything there. 
But if, if okay, I mean, okay, yeah, yeah. Inside. I mean, if that's the case, then you don't. But then you don't uh, walk up at all, right? Yeah. yeah like yeah. if you say you, there's no way you can fight it, because I think maybe I they can fight it. Stuk of Root and Cocoon. Like maybe they, they have a play there, but. Yeah, I mean, if the, I think they can be there in case the blue team mispositions. But the Anubias ran it down on the point. And <laughs> yeah. You, you can, you can do that. I don't know why he wasn't the, on the point actually. Well, and, uh, that should do. Looks very rough. Bullet used on Tychus, so he doesn't have it for Anubarak right now. Graymin at 13 actually so close. Running around mounted, pewing yeah. everyone. Yeah. And you can't even notice he has ping. Like, uh, <laughs> quite impressive actually. Maybe it's hard to see, but I think he plays it very well anyway. It's scary though, right? Because it means if you meet this man on low ping, he does yeah, all of yeah, these yeah. things quite a bit better as well. <laughs> and Ubarak uh, gets Omega combo. But they had no follow up on the PTS as well. As well. Yeah. Cocoon wasn't used to get. Like, he just gets farmed actually. Yeah. They punish him too hard. I mean, it's a new build, garbage. But uh, he also. I mean, the blue team played it well and he played it quite poorly. Like, yeah, as the tank, we uh, have a very nice grand final coming up, though. I think this is kind of the, the yeah. matchup I yeah, wanted. Yeah. But uh, given how <coughs> kind of, I mean, this game was very dominant, right, from the blue team. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah from start to finish. Bit back and forth, but uh, they, I felt like they were in the driver's seat most of the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah they were. Mm. It could have been full European final if we didn't run it. <laughs> But it is what it is. <laughs> Hyde Let's plays see. it perfect. Yeah, Hyde is uh, Hyde is playing. I mean, he play, he plays very well, right? We saw that in CCL season one as well. Yeah. He did have a lot of good plays, even though Hyde ping and. Uh, I mean, it was a rough team. Uh, Wait, <sighs> Anub almost picked the right talents. But why does he pick this le level 4 if he has the W on 7 and 13? Like the level 4 is so OP. The movement speed on 4? Yeah, it's so OP. Uh. Oh, I, I just like cringing it. <laughs> <laughs> Unlucky. <laughs> Unlucky. Yeah. Uh, Unlucky Uki. I mean, he was leaping around, but it wasn't enough, sadly. Yeah. I think they also didn't hit uh, Hanzo Arrow this game, or at least none of the impactful ones. Um, yeah. They tried, but it looked very rough. <laughs> Wait, my my dog just barked at my cat, and then the cat got super scared and like ran around in a circle. <laughs> it's <looked, it> <laughs> very weird. Uh. Abusing OP heroes yeah, is not yeah, enough. Yeah. Yo, calm down, Johan. You're abusing Samurai every game. <laughs> Don't blame Uki for picking Sonya. I mean, the, the Sonya this game, I don't think was as good. The, the draft 